In today's video, we're going to show you how to open up an existing check, um, add items to those checks, print the checks, and pay out those guest checks. So I'm going to go and hit the list checks just to see what we currently have open, which doesn't work because I have to sign in. So I'm going to sign in my employee, then hit list checks, and we get a list of our guest checks here. Select the check that you want to open, press open. You see that we get our check there on the display and you get a hyphenated line. Everything above the line has already been previously rung up, usually sent to the kitchen printer. Everything that's going to show up below the line is going to be new items. So we're going to go ahead and go into our menu, select our items to add, and if our item has a modifier it's going to come up and ask us our modifier options. Done always takes us back to the home screen. And then I'm going to go ahead and save that check. Those new items then will get sent to the kitchen printer, not the items that have been previously sent. Now I'm going to go ahead and pull up that check again. I believe it was check one and open check. Forgot to sign in my employee again, so I'm going to sign in my employee. Now enter in one, open up the check. And there's our guest check there. Now I'm going to go ahead and print this check now so we can take it to our table and present it to the table. I'm going to go ahead and sign back in using our one employee. And we'll use list checks this time. Pull that check up. Now that customer has paid or they're ready to pay. So I'm going to now pull my check up and I'm going to go into payment and we're going to go ahead and pay the check out. Now, if I select cash, the register is going to assume it's going to be exact change. Or alternatively, I can enter an amount using the number pad over here, and the register will calculate the change for us. Um, if you're using the integrated credit card feature, what you can do is you can just hit your credit card, and then you'll slide your card on the terminal or on the, the pin pad, just depending on what integration that you have and that will go through and send the amount and process automatically. It'll come right back with an approval and, and your receipt and you're ready to go. But this time I'm gonna pay it out to cash and I'll just do, let's say $150 cash. And if I entered that incorrectly, which I don't think I did, let's try that again. Okay, then so now that check is paid for, it's gone, it's cleared. If I sign back in, and I go back into my list checks, you'll notice that that check number one is, is no longer there. If you need uh, service or uh, programming, give us a call at National Business Systems, 1-800-863-2274, or uh, visit us on the web at uh, nbsystems.com.